Kukush, of course, has a good game plan. We've seen that already. The big win against Milica Mandic. Walton overreaching there with the punch. Trying to get it going early here. Good aggression from the Fayakus. And good defence there from Walton. Taking her time. The Gam John straight away for the Fayakus. Hits the deck. Walton into the lead here. Packed house here in Wushi, they're big Taekwondo fans. Ah! They'll be big fans of the winner of this one. Who's going to get it done at the moment? It's Walton just by that gam joint. And there's a nice little push to the body there from the fire coos. And indeed another bit of holding there. So Coos has turned it around here. A two-point lead. Walton going back to the push kick to the body there, going to that stabbing motion that served us so well this season. Kuss working hard. Until the last 30 seconds of the first round here. It's been good times for the Turk so far. A little hook kick to the body attempted there from Walton. And the game plan working so far, so good from the Fayakus. Walton trying for the big headshot upstairs there. No space, and it is Kuss taking her time. Speaking of which, 10 to go in the first. You can just about hear Ali Sahin in the background, the Turkish coach giving advice. Well, plenty of advice, and in Fayakus leading by three points to one in this second round, the second semi final of this Grand Slam in the heavyweight females. Walton trying for the hook round the corner. The Fayakus does well to stay on her feet there. Chop kick over the shoulder from Walton. And three lets it roll on. Kuss doing well to block on the inside, controlling the match well at the moment, the young Turk. Walton trying with the headshot over the top. Into the open stance. Both fighters just looking at each other. Nafaya Kuss confident, concentrating, hasn't really done much in this second round so far. Good attempted headshot there from Walton. Good balance as well from the British fighter. Did well not to fall. Stabbing shot around the corner. Asking for a video replay to say that there was no Gamjon merited. Looking for the Gamjon to be invalidated. It's working well at the moment for Nafaya Kuss. times now for the video replay team looking for the Gamjon both fighters holding hands there a little bit when well, they came to fight not to dance this is the coach's view fingers locked up surely that's from both well this could prove very important now significant stress for Walton was indeed holding off the hand and holding on to the lead, Nafaya Kuss. Morgan trying to push forward. Good 
punch from Walton on the way through here. That one scores. Nafak, who's on the edge of the mat. Walton trying to work away. Again, John given for the Fayakus for stepping out. So Walton having to dig deep into her reserves here. A minute left in the second. Good headshot attempt there from the Fayakus. Walton trying to work. The Fayakus. She's lost a bit of momentum here, has the Turkish fighter. Can she get it back? Well, Ali Sahin is certainly going to try to do that. You can see the consternation on the face of the coach looking for the Gamjon to be invalidated it's all tied up four points apiece here in the second well key times now for the video adjudication panel Ali Sangin's protestation unsuccessful. I think Ali Sangin just clarifying which period of the video was being reviewed there. It's immaterial now for Team Turkey. It's four points apiece. The Gamjohn's on the board, but good from Team Turkey on the way through there. There's a headshot attempt. Getting closer, Walton trying to battle her way forward. Going for the headshot, and the Fayakus hanging on. And then Walton, who manages to score on the way through there. Last 20 seconds of an engrossing second round here. Walton was points down. Really had to grip it out and grapple for a win here. And the Fayakus trying to fire forward now. Another Gamjohn making it better viewing for the British fighter as we creep down into the last seconds of the second round. Well, normal order, final round here. This is the semi final of the women's heavyweight 67 and above. Good movement from the Fayakus. Walton likewise circling, stalking her prey, trying to change the angle of attack. Perfect view in a fantastic arena for the fighters. Can Kuz find a way through here? Trying to counter. Walton just battling and mauling her way forward. The referee keeping good control of this one. Walton again trying to pop out that front leg. Nafayakus very much on the defensive now. Only needs a headshot though, and she's got all the ability. Can the Turkish fighter find an answer here, or will it be well, this season's top fighter, the undefeated Walton? And she's going to get the gam on for kicking low there, or holding, I should say, on the inside. Two point game. Less than a minute to go now. Nafayakus trying to go for that headshot over the shoulder. Walton concentrating, big punch well blocked there by Walton. Holding on the inside there. Aaron Cook defeated earlier in the golden score round. He doesn't want to see Bianca Walton in the same position. And the fire Kuss, well she wouldn't mind it. Headshot attempted there from Walton. Good defence from Kuss. Back leg turning kick just missing there. Nafayakus working hard here to try and get back into this. 20 seconds to go. Walton in the ascendancy. Controlling the match nicely. Lovely step around the corner there. Last 10 seconds now. Walton working. Nafayakus trying to push forward. Nice footwork from Bianca Walton. Big step through there. The headshot from Nafayakus wasn't enough in the end but there was an extra point will be added but it's more than enough for Walton